look at old school. Oh, look it, I'm just in time for us to fucking separate, right? I would love to see something while I mean, Kyle, go home. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. What, what were you saying? You would love it if I went home? Your butt is tiny as fuck. W yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> My butt is tiny as fuck? I'm not talking to you. Oh. Well, damn, I was getting excited. You had that booty booty. Send pics. No. I'm kidding. Of course I'm kidding, bro. Of course I'm kidding. Were you there the day when he was, I was like, is that your girlfriend? And he's like, yeah. And I was like, tell her I said hi. And then he was like, you want to talk to her? And I was like, no, 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 no. Alright, I put my sign down at that bonfire. Which one you guys at? Uh, the, right out, the same one we were just at for the, what's the part this boss. Demon Ruins? Yep. That's pretty fucking crazy though. This nigga went and had lunch by the time it took me to make my lunch. I don't care what he says, that's actually disgusting now. Tony, what'd you have for lunch? <laughs> what'd you do for lunch? I'm interested, genuinely interested. Cause that was fast as fuck. Yo, this, yo, Kyle, this dude we used to work with, the oh, fuck. <laughs> Took his it took his happy trail and shaved it into a heart. Lit. Does he listen to fucking fucking riff raff? Sounds like something a riff raff fan would do. Pomade fries? What kind of fries is that? You guys ever hear of pomade fries? You know what that is? Or am I just fucking retarded? I bet it's like seasoned fries. It's for the gram. Bitches love the gram. He's fucking, he's doing Roxanne! Roxanne! I know. Oh, Where is he that he's night. fucking like in a room with like eight bunk beds? That's jail, bro. That's prison shit right there. Or he's in like boot camp or some shit. He's in juvie. He's in, he's in somewhere that's not good. He's in a government building. <laughs> That shit was, that shit was hilarious. You hear what I said, Biggums? Yeah. He is in a fucking government building. Whatever it is, he's in a government building. Only the government would put fucking eight bunk beds in one room like that. Or a church. He's either in a government building or a church, and even still, churches are funded by the government. Just so you guys know, this is how I'm coming into this next fight right here. This is how I'm coming into this next fight right here. Dual shield. Let me just give me like two seconds. You know what? Maybe I shouldn't come in here like this on Jared. I really don't think you should come in like that. Yeah, I know. I probably shouldn't. Huh? I also still don't think that's how those benefits work. Well, you know what? It doesn't hurt to fucking try. All right. To anybody watching this stream, I will find you. A unique set of skills. Alexa, set a timer for 10 minutes. Time stops when you're washing your face. Quote Einstein, 1974. I, I miss being that high where I thought that might happen. I miss being high in general, <laughs> Biggums. Tell me all about it. Bro, hey, you want to hear a funny acid trip I had one time? This sounds like it's going to be no. terrible. Yes, I would. It's a great story. I'm waiting for Biggums to stop hearing his other story, so that way he can hear this. He needs to fucking hear this. An acid trip story for you when you're ready to listen to it. Okay. I'm... I'll come back. My, my silence is your cue. Oh, okay, okay. I didn't know. <laughs> I was waiting for you to say I'm ready to listen to it. <laughs> okay, so. It was St. Patrick's Day, right? Oh, well, yeah, gotta get the tone set. And, Every fucking year for St. Patrick's Day, the town I lived in at the time is, is the town's called Murphy's. They every day on St. Patrick's Day they would shut the because it's like the town is on like one fucking road, right? Like it's all one mm -hmm. main street. And every yeah. year, hi, right, hang on a second. <laughs> every fucking <laughs> every fucking year for St. Patrick's Day, they do this thing. <laughs> 
They do this thing <laughs> called called Murphy's Irish Day, <laughs> and they <laughs> don't let it distract you. <laughs> I'll just let this run its course for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's so funny. <laughs> it was like a mini Roger. It's my brother. He's fucking great. He's so nice. <laughs> no, but it's like it was, it's like mini Roger is terrorizing you. <laughs> <laughs> he is like a fucking mini Roger, bro. I'm pretty sure he even pretty sure he even had like a bottle of root beer in his hand instead of wine. Right, so I was not. I, I just wasn't ready for that. I'm sorry. <laughs> I deal with it every day of my life. I mean, so let me finish my fucking story, all right? All right. So, every year for St. Patrick's Day, they shut down the main street and they have parades and they fucking have little fucking booths and shit for Irish Day, right? Mm-hmm. The street, like I lived right on the end of the town, so like my house would be part of the fucking road that was like shut down at the time. You know what I'm saying? So I could just literally walk out my fucking front door and walk down the street and fucking go enjoy Irish days and shit. I did like two and a half hits. You're ready to proceed here, Vigums? All right, proceed. Still, all right, are you still are you still following along so far? I'm coming down hella hard, bro, and like I'm like again, I'm like you never get in the come down where like you're super high and you really start seeing shit. You know what I'm saying? Shit just isn't what it really seems like. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Are you saying yes? Or are you just mm -hmm on your food? Mm -hmm. Walking home and it's like three o'clock in the fucking morning, bro. And everything is like shut down. Like there's nobody in the on the fucking street. The parades are over. There's no cars. It's fucking dark as shit. And I'm walking down this long fucking straightaway to to my house. And I'm fucking frying balls at this point. And I'm like walking, and then out of nowhere, bro, I see this fucking group of leprechauns dude i see, literally i see and this is this is real shit too i see a group of fucking leprechauns huddled together in the middle of the road bro and they're like standing over something and i start tripping bro i'm like dude these leprechauns just murdered somebody and they're fucking like standing over his body right now and shit i walk a little closer bro and like one of them like turns and looks at me i'm like are you guys leprechauns and they're like it was a real per it was real people and they're just like they're just like no we're just painting clovers on the road <laughs> they were fucking deep, but I was tripping so hard. I was like, oh my god, you guys scared the fuck out of me, dude. I was like, you guys don't know what I was thinking, dude. But it, they were literally people dressed like leprechauns just <laughs> huddled in a fucking circle in the middle of the fucking street. My favorite part about this is the second you asked, are you leprechaun, <laughs> they knew for a fact what was happening. <laughs> Bro, I was just like, you should, like, the look in my eyes was just pure fear. Because I thought I was about to get gang raped by leprechauns, bro. And that's why I, you don't take their lucky charm. So, I, I have, I have a story. Um, I tell was me, tell at me my anyway. boy's house. Uh -huh. And we were, we were doing acid. Mm -hmm. And... So he had this, my boy had this girl over, and she was weird. She was weird as fuck. So she decided for the first time she wanted to do acid, she wanted to wear elf ears. And oh. that shit, like, looked like it melded with her head. Oh my god. I don't so remember you telling me this story. What? I don't remember you telling me this story. Yeah, I know. That's because I try not to remember it. <laughs> Great. Um, Wait, why would so... that explain why he doesn't remember it? So, I... So after a little bit of us like smoking and like it being a while and being like close to like three, four in the morning, I decide, all right, I'm gonna drive home. So I get in my car and I didn't realize there was glass on the ground in front of my car outside oh, no. my friend's house. So I drove a little bit forward and my tire popped, and I didn't realize because I'm fucked up on acid and the <laughs> world is the world just looks slanted to me. <laughs> And, and I'm just like, drove oh, home fine. with a fucked off tire. I'm 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 driving down the street. Every I think everything's fine, and my boys come outside and they start waving their hands. They're like they're like, yo yo, stop driving the car. So I'm like, okay okay okay. I'm just gonna pull over. Everything's gonna be fine. So I decide, all right, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna walk home. And like it's like a 20 minute drive for me to get home. It's like a two and a half hour walk to get home. So. I decided, all right, I'm gonna walk home. And this girl decides she's gonna walk home with me. So I get like halfway down my boy's street and I look at this girl, I'm like, look, I live in Cranford, you live in Kenilworth. I, you're gonna be walking by yourself for a little bit. 
And she was like, oh, fuck that, I don't want to do that. And she, like, turns around, and it's, like, 3 o'clock, 3 or 4 in the morning, and she starts screaming for my my friends, like, at the top of her lungs. Oh and so I'm God. like, oh, fuck, I gotta get away from this bitch. And <laughs> cops called on her, and I'm too fucked up for this. You're like, I gotta get away from her. So I, I walk, I, like, I speed walk down the street. And I start, I start walking, and I get to like the major highway that he lives next to, and I'm just like looking, and it's like dead, like there's no one around, and I'm just like creeping along, like fucking, <laughs> like a, like an evil villain is like sneaking through a house <laughs> across this major highway, and I walk into the, I walk into the Seven Eleven. Holy and shit! I, I look, I look messed up. Look at this fucking guy, bro. It's the nameless king, Mini Me. Oh wow. You better have some heels and look at my cage. I got heels. <laughs> I got heels. I got what you need. I I don't I say it like I, that. I walked home. Yeah. <laughs> with no shoes on. Oh my god. Just let me get a cube of ice cream. A cube of ice cream. A like, heel of ice cream. A heel? <laughs> <laughs> what is it? A, a fucking... A hammock of cake. You know what I'm talking about weed, right? A cue of ice cream? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I get it now. I get it now. Do you know what I'm talking about, though, Biggums? <laughs> no. Bro, you remember the fucking one where, like... Peter is like, he's all like, this is fucking worse than the time I fucking was the fucking, fucking diet, dietrician or whatever for some fat bitch. And he's sitting there and he's like, where are you getting these measurements from? <laughs> like, he, a hammock of cake. <laughs> and then she's like, where are you getting these measurements from? And she's like, Mary. <laughs> and he's like, okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> tell me that's not tits, bro. Yeah, uh, a desk of cheeses. Where are you getting these measurements? <laughs> a measurement drum from? of jelly. Like, is that like a drum they ship oil in? Apparently, invaders love Look at love fucking my Tony and his fucking thrall hood, bro. This, that's, he looks like Oogie Boogie yeah, from okay. Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah. I'm using my lightning Drake blood sword plus ten. Plus ten. Plus ten. Plus ultra. Wow, this thing fucking sucks, honestly. If it wasn't for its lightning damage, dude, that would fucking blow dick. Alright, now we just need uh, good old Tony Tone. Come, come. Alright, Tony's coming. Gross. Yeah. Totally turbulent juices. And the men are coming. And they're coming strong. Somehow what? you made this weirder than I did. <laughs> 